they committed themselves after they had developed the basic industrial modern society, they targeted the United States as their model to surpass, as their model to overcome, and that they have worked ceaselessly to do, so that they are the place where the best modern electric vehicles are produced, and they are the, the only part of the world that can compete with, with Google, with uh, Apple, with Intel, with any of the other highest levels of technological modernization that have been achieved in the West. Yes, the neocons that control government here in the United States portray them as the great evil. Yes, they have certainly surpassed the Soviet Union and quite long ago in being economically more developed and therefore with a greater base for whatever military they've thought to do. So let me turn then to the politics of China. Yes, China has a dominant political reality, and that is the Communist Party of China. It is the dominant political party, no question. It is against capitalism and for socialism. But before you rush to whatever that might mean to you, think about this. In the Chinese view, the United States has a political dominance of a pro-capitalist political party. For them, it has two wings, Republican and Democrat, two different wings that agree that capitalism should be, could be, and must be the dominant reality of the United States. Well, the Chinese argue that's exactly their view for socialism. So yes, they exclude capitalism, but they point to the United States as excluding socialism. You could like one and not the other, but you can't pretend that they're all that different. The Communist Party in China has one wing. The Capitalist Party in the United States, they argue, has two. And the Americans get to choose between those two and nothing else. No one else is allowed to intrude on that monopoly except on the edges, and that's where they're kept, and that's where they've been for the last 70 years, just like the monopoly the Chinese Communist Party operates, the Capitalist Party in the United States operates the same. 